Good morning, Dawn Watchers. It is time again to get up and let's meditate the Word of God together. It's our fourth day. Luke 10, 2 says, Then he said to them, The harvest truly is great, but the laborers are few. Therefore pray to the Lord of the harvest so that he will send more laborers in the field. There is an urgency of the harvest the field is ready. It's time to bring the harvest into the barn. Gathering is here to avoid spoilage. In this passage, people are likened into a harvest. They are ready to hear the good news. And the good news is, Jesus lived, he died, and he rose again on the third day, which is the final day of victory over sin and death. And Jesus is coming back soon. The Lord Jesus himself was talking about the greatness of the harvest. But the laborers are few, so he encouraged his followers to pray to the Lord of the harvest so that he will send more laborers in the field. Now we cannot say, I have to wait another generation or next year or another time. The field is ripe and ready for the harvest. It's harvest time, mga kapatid. Samantalahin natin ito. We have to go and win the loss. Huwag nating sayangin ang ibinigay na panahon sa atin. Romans 1.16 says, For I am not ashamed of the gospel, but it is the power of God for salvation to those who believe. Today, we are calling all radical Christians who are not afraid to share their faith in Christ, knowing that only Jesus, the name above all names, the only name given under heaven and earth, who has the power to save. Come out from your comfort zone. Matagal na kayong nananahimik, not sharing the gospel. It's time to speak it out loud. Souls are waiting. They're dying without hope. No God, no peace, no future. I'm blinded by all the lies and deceptions of Satan. We need courageous believers who are willing to sacrifice and live for the cause of Christ. Christians who are on fire to win the lost no matter what. Our theme this year is dedicated and devoted to the end. Not loving our lives so much even to death. Set aside fear. This is the right time to be bold and courageous. Let us shout the name of Jesus, the hope of salvation and our eternal life. Like the prophet Isaiah, we have to say this together. Lord, here I am send me. Now, let us pray. Lord God, empower us with your spirit and make us bold as lion to share the good news. Send us to the harvest field and let us win the loss together. Amen. Join me again tomorrow. God bless you. Music